just wanted to show you very quickly how to install these waterproof automotive connectors. Uh, probably the most common type of connector you can get on the internet. So I'm just going to show you very quickly how to fit the pins. So first of all you're going to want to get the weatherproof seals. Slide them onto your cables. You want to make sure they go on this way around because that's the way they need to uh, face in the in the uh, connector. Then you can either use a watch stripper like this, or if you're doing a lot of these, these are definitely the best type. And you can just strip. As you can see that just a very small amount off the end. And what you do is you slide your yellow seals back down. It's just so they're like so, just on the end of the on the end of the wire. These are non-insulated ratchet crimping. And then what we do is Need to just give them a slight squeeze. Pop the in on this one because we're going for a one mil. And then slide this all the way in. So we're trying to do. Let me show you. You're trying to get this on there like that. So what we're going to do, give it a squeeze like so. And then, and there we are, perfect. You can see just there how the cable is just underneath and yet we've crimped the weather seal. Perfect. So you want to do that for all of your connectors. Same again. There we are. And once you've got those in, when you look at the connector here, one side on the bottom, so with that at the top, the bottom is a clip. So what you need to do is you just need to make sure you put the cable in this way. Or is it that way? Helps if you put it in the right connector. There we are, see it's popped up. Then with the other side, slide it in. 
No, definitely that way. There we are. And once you've done that with all your connectors, you then put your locking tabs in. And with the other end, same thing. Slide your pins in, push them until they click. Slide them in, push till they click. And there you go. One completed connector. Thanks for watching. Check out my other videos.